A Chromebook is a laptop or tablet running the Linux-based Chrome OS as its operating system. The devices are primarily used to perform a variety of tasks using the Google Chrome browser, with most applications and data residing in the cloud rather than on the machine itself. 1. Price The first thing that will stand out when you go shopping for a Chromebook is the fact that they are really cheap. Most Chromebooks go for $300 to $400, but there are models that can cost as low as $200. Meanwhile, a mid-range Windows laptop can easily cost four times or more than this amount. Whether you're an individual user or are buying laptops for a business, you can get huge savings when you buy a Chromebook. There is a bit of a caveat in this aspect, as there are now Windows laptops that are in the $300 to $400 price range, so the price gap is no longer as pronounced as it was a few years ago. 2. Weight Since Chromebooks do not rely on powerful hardware or large storage spaces, they are generally thinner and lighter than traditional laptops. The enhanced portability makes Chromebooks a great choice for workers who need to move around a lot. With Chromebooks, carrying your laptop in your bag or carry-on bag no longer needs to be a huge burden. 3. Battery life. With less power intensive processes, a Chromebook can typically stretch its battery life of at least 8 hours. This is especially impressive considering their thin and lightweight construction. Most traditional laptops would be lucky to last up to 6 hours, and that usually comes with the price of heavy and clunky batteries. 4. Cloud based storage. Buying a Chromebook also gives you two years of access to 100 GB of Google Drive storage. This is a huge amount of cloud-based space that will normally cost a large amount if you get it from another platform, such as Dropbox. Having all your files synced to cloud-based storage allows you to access them from different workstations and from your phone. It also facilitates collaboration between remote workers. 5. Extensive Library of Android Apps The merging of Chrome OS and Android was a huge development that massively enhanced the possibilities of what you can go with a Chromebook. Modern Chromebooks can now access and download apps from the Android library through the Google Play app. This includes apps from Microsoft and Adobe, as well as mainstream apps such as Netflix, Slack, and Evernote. With a library that has more than 1 million apps and continues to grow every day, there is near limitless potential for Chromebooks in the future. One, small storage capacity. Since Chromebooks focus on cloud-based storage via Google Drive, most Chromebooks only have local storage of up to 256 GB. This is one of the ways that manufacturers have kept Chromebooks cheap and lightweight. This is not as much of a drawback considering the 100 GB of Google Drive storage that comes with new Chromebooks. You will probably only need local storage for the Android apps that you will be installing, most of which are also very light. 2. Offline use The Chrome OS and most of the apps for Chromebooks rely heavily on an active internet connection. Some of these apps, such as the Pixel Photo Editor, may not be usable at all if you are not online. However, app developers have recognized this limitation and added some offline capabilities to their software. Apps such as Google Docs and Gmail can save local versions on the cache of your Chromebook, which then sync to their cloud-based counterparts as soon as an internet connection becomes available. 3. Lack of Compatibility Although Chromebooks are more popular now than they have ever been, there is no doubt that most of the software being developed are still being made to work with Windows. You can find practically any type of software that is compatible with your workstation if you are using a Windows laptop. The same cannot be said for Chromebooks despite its access to an ever-growing Android library. Thus, Chromebooks will always have to play catch-up with Windows in terms of software compatibility. 4. Graphics and Gaming Chromebooks are not designed to have powerful graphics processors, so any sort of high-end gaming is out of the question. There are a few games that you can download via Google Play, but these are the same sort of games that you can play on your mobile phone. 
Chromebooks are also notorious for having disappointingly low resolution displays, and the difference is very noticeable if you're used to working with full HD displays. 5. Using peripheral hardware. The focus of Chromebooks on internet-based services will force users to do things differently. Even mundane things such as printing a document, which has to go through the Google Cloud print service, and watching a movie, which can only be done through a streaming service such as Netflix, have to be done through some sort of online component. This can take a little getting used to. Chromebooks are great for professionals and students who are looking for cheap and lightweight laptops. The modest specs of Chromebooks are good enough for minimal computing needs such as office work or photo editing. A network of Chromebooks who work entirely on the cloud also sounds like a great idea for an office that puts a lot of importance in collaboration. Chromebooks are also an excellent choice for remote workers who need to move around a lot. A professional that needs powerful hardware, such as a video editor, will also have very little use for a Chromebook. Lastly, a Chromebook is not for you if you spend a lot of your time working offline.